Okay guys, what's up? I haven't made a video in a couple days and mainly because the markets have, I mean, yes, they've been up, but I mean, I've had a little bit harder time playing them and don't get me wrong, I'm not the only one. This is a little bit harder of a market when the market's been selling off, they've been grinding up, back, and then boom, right back down. Um, Trump has, every time Trump releases news, the market goes ballistic, it's very volatile, it's, which makes it harder to trade sometimes. Um, but I like the volatility. I mean, I've made a lot of money in the past couple of weeks, and I've also had a couple small losses. I mean, I haven't had like a real loss, like a thousand dollar loss or something, in a while. So, still feel really good about that. But right now, I want to go over Timothy Sykes and what I think of him. Whether he's a fraud, whether he's not, and I'm gonna be point blank. I don't think he's a fraud. I think he's a genius. Just really, really smart guy. And this is him right here. Um, if you go to the beginning of his website, my internet's probably a little bit slow right now. I'm downloading a couple things. But this is, you can watch this. It kind of tells his story, how he took like, yeah, $12,415 to a little over, or almost $5 million now. But let's go to testimonials. Um, if you go to blogs, we'll cover that, I think, in a minute. Um, he's got a bunch of those. But realistically, I just want to go over a couple main points. Is he a fraud? No. Now, the other question I have when new traders come to me, they're like, should I join the Tim Sykes Challenge or stuff like that? <coughs> I don't tell them no. I don't tell them yes. And f there's a reason for that. If you're going to make your decision, if you want to do something, you're going to do it. Now, if you just want to learn stocks, I'm not saying you have to go through Tim Sykes. I mean, you have Warrior Trading, you have Faust 4 and Faust Alerts, um, what's the other one, Tandem Trader, um, all of those different systems. But the guy that's had the most millionaire results, I want to say, is Tim Sykes. Now, don't get me wrong, it's expensive. Um, I signed up for it at one point, and then I said... And then, like, because I've already been, I was already trading at that point. I signed up for it. I got approved for the Millionaire Challenge, and he told me it was like six thousand dollars. It wasn't Tim; it was his business guy, the guy that takes, basically, covers the challenge for him and does all the backside work. And he told me it was like six thousand something dollars. And when you're in college or when you're broke, like when I was first starting out, I mean, I didn't have much money. I kept. Winning one, two, three trades, and they were small wins, but then I would have one big loser to wipe all those out. And I had a small account, so it would be like a $10 win, a $10 win, a $10 win, a $10 win, a $50 loss, and just wipe it all out. And it sucked. It really did suck at the beginning. But again, you see those wins, and that's what you thrive on. I mean, I'm a competitor, so I love that winning. And like when you take a loss, you're just like, okay, I know what I did. We got to fix this. And I think I learned a little faster because of that. But this is his best student yet today, I think. I may have that wrong. It may be a couple, another guy. But this is Tim Gatani. Um, he's actually got a DVD out called Trading Tickers. Again, they were on Fox News. They've been on CNN, I believe, with him. This is Roland Wolf. But you can see his profits here. I mean, he does a lot of overnight trades, too. That's how he got there. Um... Tim Gatani is a short seller mainly, but that's how Tim made his money too. And Tim still does trade. Um, I don't have Tim alerts or anything like that. I did at the very, very beginning when I was first starting. Um, you can't follow his trades. They're, they're too late, and he tells you not to. I, I do give him that. He tells you not to follow his trades, and I was just tracking data. I wasn't trading exactly off of his ideas. But at one point, I wanted to see if I could, and his alerts were so late that you can't, but you do see what he's trying to t show you and stuff like that. So it is, it's not bad to learn off of, but Timoth Timothy Sykes in general, you guys have to realize that this guy makes a lot of money. So let me open up my calculator <coughs> and pull it up over here. Okay, it's not going to let me show it on the side. Okay, I have another monitor. But his silver plan, I believe, is $75 a month. And let's say he has a thousand people in here. So that's 75 times a thousand. He makes 
thousand dollars a month off of just that. And penny stocking silver is a hundred and seventy-five dollars a month. I don't know how many people have that. Um, you can do the math. But this is his best student, I think, lately. And this is Stephen Ducks. He did it in the shortest amount of time, but he also started with thirty thousand dollars. What this doesn't tell you. It says zero, but he had a thirty thousand dollar, I believe. I want to. S no, I don't know, but I've heard a lot of people say he had thirty thousand dollars. But you see his profitly chart, and these are verified trades. It's very good, very smart guy. Um, I'm in the middle of watching his DVD actually right now. I do buy other people's DVDs and listen to them. Um, these are other students that are making money. Um, this guy's almost up a thousand dollars. I don't know when these people started. I don't really know these, but I do know the big names: Ducks, Roland. Gatani, um, there's another guy, Mark. He's made quite a bit of money. Mark Crook, I think. Something like that. But anyways, you do get a ton of value for what he gives you. Now, I'm not saying that you have to do this to be a profitable trader. What I am saying is that he's a better teacher now than he is a trader, I want to say. And I say that because he doesn't make as many of those great trades as he used to. Now, it could be that he spends so much of his time doing his social media. If he has following, he has over a million followers on Instagram, a ton of people on Facebook, a ton of people on Twitter. And he probably does so much when it comes to the actual business side because he also has the trading software, Stocks to Trade. And that's like $150 a month, so you add all that up, I mean, he's making good money every... He's probably making, I don't know, $500,000 a month. I really don't know. That I'm just saying that. I don't really know. Again, I haven't broke it down. I can make a video breaking it down if you want. Just leave a comment, and I'll do that. But the main thing here is these people are doing it, but they also study a lot. And if he's spending so much time on his businesses, he doesn't get to spend as much time trading, more unlikely, as he would like. So that means, it doesn't mean he's became a bad trader now. It just becomes, he is a great teacher now. And he has a ton of students, don't get me wrong. And he said, so, well, you can be an affiliate and stuff like that. Um, but let's go to his blog. And he does tell a lot of his stories. Um, how they made a ton of money sitting on a yacht. I've read a lot of these when I first started. Um, Tim Gatani. Um, he's been on the show with him. Um, his Lamborghini. He does post some douche, some douchebag pics. But you know what? We're all a little bit douchey when... But you gotta do this to advertise to people. So I do understand this. I don't think he's a douche. I think he's a smart guy. Again, I think he's a genius. I honestly do. I would love to work with him. If he ever saw this, hit me up. I'll be glad to work with you. I love having my financial freedom. But if you're this smart, you've made this big of a business, love to work with you. Um, he travels a lot now. And this is his software. Um, I'm thinking about getting it just to do a review for you guys for a one month or maybe his one week trial, which is a dollar. <coughs> he does travel a lot. He does post douchey pics of money. But if you had that much money, so would you. And he makes it without even trading, I believe. His Ferrari, he's got Lamborghinis, he's got, he got a new car too. But anyways, we're just going to go to results for the one last thing. I want to keep this decently short. And then I'll go over, um, this is just a lot of reviews, I guess. Um, he's not going to show bad ones, but people, entry and exits. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of these. But if you go to a store, I mean, these are pretty expensive. I'm not going to lie. And you have all of these. And if you want to actually buy one, let's go... I want, dang, I don't even know. Let's just go here, Bird Ducks, Shorts, what the heck? Oh, in order to learn about his DVDs now, you can't just buy them, you have to give him your email and stuff like that, and he'll, I'm guessing he'll email you. Um, 
But he does go over just about everything. And he does go over the preferred brokers. Yeah, see, this is Tim Alerts. This is the challenge. So it's $149.95 a month. This is $74.95. So basically, $75. Bucks. And then this is $6,000 something dollars. Which, don't get me wrong, it's probably worth every penny. Um, this is just basically like his page. Um, but yeah. Again, if you add all these up and you got to think about it, he's probably got over a thousand people in this chat room at the moment. So you got to think about how much he gets paid on a monthly, no matter what, whether he trades or not. <coughs> so I just want to thank you guys. Um, I want to leave you with, I think he's a great teacher. Um, I'm not sure if he's a great trader anymore because he doesn't trade as much as he used to because he's so busy, I want to assume. But he used to be a great trader, great guy, very smart guy. I like how he throws a couple F-bombs around and stuff like that. That's how you know he's keeping it real. He's not fake behind it. Um, I just wasn't really raised to be like that. Um, every now and then, one slips, and like I feel like my mom is just like staring me in the back like, what did you say? But that's okay. And same with my dad. But overall, um, I want you guys to leave comments on like what you want me to think. And I can go back over some of this stuff. You guys want me to go into more detail on certain things. Um, but the watch lists are nice. And remember, if he's got that many people in his chat room, he's got people looking at all of these stocks. And they can pump. Don't get me wrong. They can pump. But they can also fail. So, good luck. And if you, guys, I hope this answered some of you guys' questions. And leave a comment below, leave a thumbs up, and let me know what you guys thought. And I'll see you guys in the next one.